Now we have options to try all four teas from the second August box from Tea Runners. Mm -hmm. So that's what we're going to do. Yeah, I, I, I actually feel like this is crazy what we're doing. We're trying four different teas. I'm, I'm excited. <laughs> anyway, so first up we've got Yogi's Tonic. Sure. Uh, this one has rose hip star anise, which I know Kailea is not excited about. Peppermint, black currant leaf, lemongrass, chamomile, lavender, wintergreen extract, and natural vanilla flavor. Um, yeah, that's the example we have on it. Yogi's tonic. Hmm. Uh oh. That's fine. Ooh, it's fine. It's, it's not a very strong taste. We did steep it for the recommended five minutes, and oh, yeah, it's I, not strong at all. I did one teaspoon per eight ounces, and I made sure that I did eight ounces in the glass. Based on, like, it needs more. It doesn't quite fit their recommended dosage, I think, <clears throat> because that needs more flavor. I mean, it's, it's not bad if you're not looking for something flavorful, if you're just wanting something yeah there's some nice things going smooth on to, to drink there's just not a lot of flavor going on yeah pretty much all I can taste is like uh, like peppermint and, and licorice I cool. don't take taste of licorice thank that's goodness. good that's good it reminds me of uh, throat coat tea which I drink when I'm sick mm -hmm. but not not as strong or sweet no. yeah okay Yogi's tonic next up now apple pie chai Ooh. Uh, with apple pieces, orange peel, organic lemongrass, organic cinnamon chips, hibiscus flowers, rose hips, organic alfalfa leaf, natural cinnamon flavor, natural nutmeg flavor, ginger flavor, and clove flavor. Apple pie chai. Hmm. Oh. Again, just not much flavor. Interesting. Maybe just because they're, they're herbal teas. I want... Hmm. I don't know. It kind of reminds me of a bit of apple cider. Ooh. Um, this one is not a, a true chai. It is caffeine free. There's no black tea in it. Uh, I know what you mean. Honestly, this just needs a little bit more because I like it a lot. Yeah. But it's, it's very weak. It just makes me want apple cider. Hot apple cider. Mm hmm. I can tell I, I would really like that otherwise, though. Okay. All Apple right. pie chai. Next up is lavender berry. Lavender berry. I don't know why I always forget. Has rooibos, lavender flowers, freeze-dried raspberries, and flavoring. And on the package it says it has some vanilla and some strawberry in the flavoring. And the tea package it smell, itself smells so good. Oh, it smells good. so good. It's, so like, good. it's like dried berries. Don't tell me it's too weak again. Is it? It is. <clears throat> I wouldn't say it's too weak, but you just get the raspberry. The raspberry scent flavor. No, it's nice. I, I... Mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's stronger than the other two. Yeah, it is. Um, I wonder if it also has something to do with how it was steeped, because it has a more aerated yeah. Steeping mechanism. Yeah, with these two, we used our, our little uh, spoon sized mm -hmm. steepers, and this one we used the individual teapot. And the individual 8 ounce mini teapot thing, right? Yeah. So yeah. Isn't that what I said? Yeah, you did the say 8 ounces. I said the individual teapot. It's yep. good. Yep, I, I think like it's it. just because they're, like it. these are all herbal teas, that is. These two are too We're not weird. used to. Okay, yeah, it could just be us not being used to it. Yeah. Anyways, last up is Cape Town. Cape Town Herbal Surprise. Sunrise. 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 The surprise was it was a sunrise. <laughs> <laughs> it has green ruibas, blueberries, papaya, orange peel, hibiscus, raspberries, mallow blossoms, sugar, interesting, marigold petals, and flavoring. That one also smelled really good. Like, we really were good. We're, this is the one I think we're the most excited for. I think so. Try, try, try. You, you're closest. Ooh, okay. That 
That's the best one. Yeah? Yeah. It's because uh, it's got sugar in it. Um, I don't know. It's very fruity, which I like. I think the apple pie chai mm -hmm. might be my favorite, though, if there was a little bit more. <clears throat> There's a lot going on in it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's tasty. Mm -hmm. So which one's your favorite? Um, either the Cape Town Purple Sunrise or the Apple Pie Chai, but not this mug of it. But a different <laughs> mug of it might be my favorite. Cause, and I, I didn't think the Apple Pie Chai would be my favorite, but what I taste in it is so nice. What's your favorite? I think the lavender berry. Really? I think so. Mmm. Yeah. This one tastes too much like grass. Grass? Yep. Oh, it must be the green rebus. <laughs> what? Why would that be there? What else is tasting gonna uh, taste like grass? I don't know. Oh, the the petals? The marigold petals maybe? Probably. There it is. Alright, cool. Uh, that was our second box of tea runners teas. Mm -hmm. All in one go. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Looking so. forward to next month. They're shipping out, I guess, next week. Hi, Coco. Do you know, did you pick or are no, you? No. Oh, okay. Okay. Waiting to be surprised. Cool. Me too. <laughs> Although this was a surprise too. I would get surprised. It's nice. uh, the thing is, is I, I pick herbal teas, which I don't usually drink and I buy them and then they sit in the cupboard because I don't really drink them. So it's mm. better if I don't pick the teas because I pick things I don't want to drink. <laughs> All right, thanks for watching, everybody.